Now, today's top stories and Power of Five weather from News 5, sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital. Hello, I'm Danita Harris, and here's a look at today's top stories. There's a renewed push for a law in Ohio that our News 5 investigators have been following for years. Aisha's Law is named after Aisha Frazier, the Shaker Heights teacher who was killed by her ex-husband in 2018. The law would make strangulation a felony in Ohio. A state representative from Cleveland Heights hopes the law will get a new hearing this week. Tonight, Rocket Mortgage Fieldhouse will welcome Harry Styles for its first full capacity event since the pandemic hit. There are new protocols in place to prevent the spread of COVID-19. Everyone is required to wear a mask and show proof of vaccination or a negative COVID test. To speed up the entry process, concert goers should download the Clear Health Pass app and enter their information before arriving. You may have seen something like um, Clear if you if you've traveled and seen it in the airport. It's the same brand. You can upload your proof of vaccination, so you don't need to carry that card around, which a lot of people don't like to do, and we understand that. Each event at Rocket Mortgage Field House will have specific safety precautions. Right now, the Cavs and Monsters are not requiring masks or proof of COVID-19 vaccination. The Cleveland Browns are now three and three this season. Oh, it was a tough loss to the Arizona Cardinals Sunday. Quarterback Baker Mayfield, wide receiver Odell Beckham Jr., and running back Kareem Hunt suffered injuries during the game. Several other key players missed Sunday's game due to injuries. The Browns have a short turnaround this week. They host the Broncos Thursday night, kickoff 820 at First Energy Stadium. Now for a look at your weather, here's meteorologist from Misha Shade. It's not over. The Browns can bounce back, and I think they will bounce back, just like our temperatures will bounce back over the next few days. But for today, feeling a lot more like fall. Those temperatures started off chilly in the 40s, and we're going to warm up to the low 60s this afternoon. We'll call that seasonable since that's right around our normal high for this time of the year. Lots of bright sunshine for your outdoor workout plans, maybe your patio plans. It's going to be nice for all of it. In fact, we keep things dry all the way through Wednesday. But you know, when we have a few dry days, usually something's coming. We've got a cold front that will roll in on Thursday. That will bring some widespread rain. I think most of that rain is out of here just in time for the Browns game. But that cold front ushers in some chilly air just in time for next weekend. Sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital.